Hello everyone, welcome to my YouTube channel. Today I'm going to be showing you guys how to make stir fry broccoli. The ingredients we need are all lined out here. Um, I've chopped my broccoli. This is the broccoli. I've got whole mushroom that I'm going to slice. I've got two carrots, my black pepper, roasted garlic and black pepper. Got my chili, two cloves of garlic, salt to taste, olive oil, and my seasoning. So, let's get started. After I boil the water, I'm going to boil the broccoli for like maybe two minutes. I'm adding salt to it. Yeah. I like feeding my family with vegetables. So I'm going to cut the, the mushrooms. Sometimes I buy the ones that have been cut, but today I just decided to do it by myself. Almost done chopping the mushrooms. If you like, you can buy the ones that have been cut, but I like doing it by myself so that I'm sure what I'm eating. This is done. So now I'm going to cut the, I'm going to chop the carrots. I've cut it into three. the carrots anyway that's what i i eat more it's not that i don't eat the broccoli my son likes the broccoli but i like the carrots almost done cutting the carrots it's a little bit hard because it's fresh carrots yeah done um let me check on the broccoli to see if it's i'm not going to cook it so much so that it won't be so soft Yeah, I think this is ready. So I'm going to strain it. This is done. I'm going to put a little bit of the olive oil into my pan. You don't need so much oil to fry. Maybe about three tablespoons, but I don't measure though. While we're waiting for the oil to heat up, I'm going to squeeze my garlic going in the pan now I like using garlic in most of my food because I like the aroma what especially when I'm frying I'm gonna put a little bit of chili some people don't but I prefer to add chili to give it a little kick it's optional if you like you can ignore that part. Then I'm going to add my roasted garlic and pepper. Put in as much as you would like. Now I'm going to throw in my carrot. Because the carrot is hard, so I like to put it in first. Mm. I like the aroma. Very inviting. I'm gonna throw in my pepper. And this carrot will give it a very good color so that everything will not be too greenish. Now I'm adding my Seasoning. Black pepper. As you like it. I'm 
This looks very good. I have one garlic more left. I want to put it in. Nice. The broccoli will go in large because um, I have steamed it, so I'm not gonna put it in now. That will be the last thing that will go into the pot or into the fr um, frying pan. Sorry. So now I'm gonna add the mushroom. So much. I like eating this with white rice. You can eat it with noodles. Instead of eating rice and stew, I serve my uh, self with this. This is really, really rich. Very nice aroma. The garlic is a really, really good one that's in this pan. I like stirring this constantly because I don't want it to get burnt. Now I'm adding the broccoli. Imagine the color. Wow. I have to put a little sprinkle of salt. more of the season since I've just added the broccoli so that the season can go on every of the vegetable in the pot. Before I didn't like to eat broccoli because the way I did it in the past was just to steam it with salt but now is that I discovered this method. I can eat this as a meal because it's got everything in it. It's got pepper, it's got garlic, it's got seasoning. So now I'm beginning to love broccoli. You can see the color. This is really, really beautiful and very yummy. So guys, I think this is ready. Wow. I love this. So thank you guys for watching. I hope to see you in my next video but please if you haven't subscribed try and subscribe hit the notification bell and put your comments on what you think about this video in the comment section thank you once again till i come your way next time bye